29 year old man is on life support. His mom hopes whoever did this will turn themselves in. Spencer Tracy shares their story of hoping he recovers from a hit and run crash. I just want him to wake up. He's, we're waiting for him to wake up. One mother says she's praying for a miracle and wants justice for her son. I never thought I was going to be put in this position where, where I'll be the mom explaining to people that my son is laying in a hospital bed dying. Mercedes Padilla says last Sunday near 16th and Forest home, someone hit her son, 29 year old Luis Herrera, while on his motorcycle. Police say the driver didn't stop, ran a red light and just kept going. The person took off. They left my son just laying there like a piece of garbage, like he wasn't worth nothing. A nearby gas station caught the crash on their surveillance camera. Seconds later, people ran to help. Edwin Santiago was one of them. Up is the 911, he started calling, sending the ambulance. That's the guy's in the floor, he's gonna, he gonna die. As police look for the driver, Herrera is fighting for his life with severe brain injuries and an amputated leg. They said that he might be completely brain dead within the next few days. His mom says he has a huge support system and three kids waiting for him to come home. We just have to keep hope, you know, keep praying. In Milwaukee, Spencer Tracy, Fox 6 News. Now, police are asking for your help to catch the driver who hit Herrera. If you saw something, you're asked to call Milwaukee police.